friends welcome back to another vlog it's been a little bit since i've like just done a normal weekly vlog because last week sorry about the lighting um i just got home um i literally ended the video and started this one so yeah but anyway i just wanted to start off this vlog say hi friends what's up what's crack a lacking also i just want to say i did change really quick i got my pajamas back on but anyway i just want to say i should probably give you guys a little rundown of what's going on this week but anyway, so today is Monday. I had my one week um, post wisdom teeth surgery appointment thing where he gave me this really cool thing that I can rinse out my gums. <laughs> um, anyway, so that was today. Tomorrow I'll work. Wednesday I'm off work. Uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday I'll work. I'm off Sunday. Then I'll work all week. I'll work Monday through Thursday next week. Okay. And then Friday, I'm leaving for Florida, and I'm, I'm so excited. I miss my bestie girl, and I'm excited to go see that heifer. I've never flown on a plane before, and I'm doing it by myself, and low-key freaking out. Actually, high-key freaking out. Um, but it's going to be great, and I'm going to be in Florida next week, and I'm thrilled. Anyway, it's a good rainy day today, and I'm loving it. I'm going to go see the grandparents, tell them I can drink out of a straw again. Very exciting stuff around here today. <laughs> Good morning, friends. So, I just wanted to say really quick that today is Halloween, but I don't really like Halloween. And so, I'm really excited that at work, we decided to launch Christmas. And we're having a Christmas pajama day instead of dressing up for Halloween. And um, I'm thrilled. Obviously, I have my What's Up Grinches sweatshirt, but, and then my onesie over this, and I'm really excited. So, yeah. Pickleball Tuesday! <laughs> a little bit of a wind chill is gonna stop us! Yeah! Alrighty friends, so it has been a hot minute since honestly, I've not really been vlogging very well this week, but I've just been sitting here on my table, my niece's table, doing my nails. But I figured I would tell you these, I'm getting my Florida prepping done the next two days. So these are my nails. Um, it's just like a little swirl pattern. Um, look up a video on like gel X nails. That's how I do them with like the full clear tips and stuff and then I use a lot of the Beatles nail brand uh, for like the glue top coat colors from Beatles are gorgeous then I'll also use the ASP brand from Sally's um this ASP bonder stuff is fantastic to start the nail process off with but for this exact design I use the ASP color in ooh la la it's very pretty very neon bright pink and then some of white hot for the design and then for the base coat of like the milky white color i used cream de la cream from ASP. Alrighty, friends good morning so i'm gonna start this video off really quick and then we'll get into filming so today's plan is i have to basically do everything in one day <laughs> So, I need to get all of my cleaning done today. I need to get all of my laundry done today. I need to wash my sheets and do all of that stuff today. I need to meal prep for four days for work today. I need to pack for Florida today. It's just, I already got my nails done, so we can cross that off my to-do list because I already done them. Um, I didn't want to lose hours at work, so I'm working the two days that I'm usually off because I'm off the two days that I usually work. That was a terrible way of explaining that. But anyway, I'm working Monday and Wednesday instead of being off Monday and Wednesday. So everything that I need to do before Florida is getting done today. And I'm thrilled.
video but then Sierra was telling me that my video was really good and so I'm gonna go text her back and then I'll explain this but I'm real happy. break at work just out here living my best life uh, I got off the phone with or I was able to talk on the phone with Gabby for a little bit and I'm just so stinking excited to see that girl sorry about the audio I'm sure you can hear my fan but I don't want to turn it off because it's all the way over there <laughs> but I just wanted to say that it is tomorrow will be three days until the day that I leave for Florida and I'm so excited. Um, I realize I haven't like updated the vlog much today, just working every day this week, so probably won't get much content other than what I got Sunday. But I'm just, I'm very excited. I can't believe like it's actually happening and that's, I mean, I'm nervous about flying for the first time, but I'm like, okay, you know? Um, but no, if I can like drive on the interstate through Lexington, I can go in an airport and get on a plane and go through security and be reunited with the bestie. And I'm, I'm so excited. So mistakes were made. <laughs> hey, Sierra, come here. What? Come here. Come here. <laughs> I ain't doing it. Okay. Of movie magic. 18 drink order. Whoa. <laughs> okay, go. You have to vlog your winning points. Okay. I have one point until I win, guys. This has for never the, happened. For the first time. For the first March. time. In, for the first time in <laughs> ever. <laughs> okay, 11 10. I love the two point rule. Oh, wait, I would have already won if it I was about the to two say. Point that was just a warm up, guys. <laughs> that was so bad. Little well, Madison did so good. She was so that she played the best game of her life. For the and first she, time ever. She played her heart out. And. The Lord probably touched oh. her like Samson, guys. <laughs> well, you didn't kill anybody with a jawbone, so you never know. You play again? Oh. <laughs> you want to play again? I do. So anyway, I don't know if any of y'all play pickleball, but if you're within two points of the other person, then you have to keep going until you're in, you win by two points, basically. So, me and her was both at 10 points, and then I got 11, and we had to keep playing, and it just, I was doing, as she beat me, but it was so close, and I've never done that well by myself before, and it just shows, you know, practice, practice helps. I mean, I'm not going to say practice makes perfect, because I still am terrible at pickleball, but at least I almost won a game. <laughs> I technically would, if it would for a technicality, I would have won, but no, I'm just, I'm real. Yeah. I really like the new rug and with the decorations. <laughs> I'm so excited. Alrighty, friends. So today is Thursday. I'm fixing to go back from my break. But tomorrow I'll leave for Florida. And I'm honestly surprised that I'm not really that nervous. Like, I'm like nervous, excited, but I'm not like freaking out nervous, which I figured I would be because. Doing something new alone scares me. Well, like flying scares me. I've always been so scared to fly. And now I'm doing it alone. And I'm very excited. So, that's good. <laughs> I'm just, I'm so stinking excited to see Gabby. And to be in Florida. 
and to have a little vacation. I'm just, I'm so excited. Um, my little coworkers, I think, of getting excited, getting tired of me talking about it. But no, it's funny. I keep like every five seconds at work, I just keep saying, "I'm so excited! I'm so excited! I'm so excited!" And so I told them they need to like do like tally marks of every time I say I'm so excited. It would probably be like 47 billion times a day. Um, <laughs> cause I say it a lot, but yeah, tomorrow, my friends, tomorrow I will be in Florida. Alrighty friends. So I just got off work and I'm headed home. Um, I would check into my flight. I could do it like 24 hours to 48 minutes before something like that. Um, before my flight. So I went ahead and checked in. I took like a 10 minute break. I said, guys, I got things to do. It wasn't busy. I took a 10 minute break and I checked into my flight. <laughs> and I asked the more experienced flyers which seat would be the best to sit in because they asked if I wanted to change my seat. And I did end up adding a carry on on there. It was like 30 extra dollars. I'm like, I could bring my Nintendo Switch with me. I can bring, you know. We was, we're going to a, a fancy fancy restaurant tomorrow after I get off the plane. So, I, she's wearing a dress. And she's like, hey, you need to bring a dress. Now I can pack a dress. I'm excited. Anyway, so I'm thrilled. Am I potentially going to shove my pillow in either my backpack or my carry-on? There's a good chance.